What's up guys, welcome to Chiefs Chat, episode 45. And in this episode, I'm gonna be responding to some questions that I got on Instagram. So, I made this post about a day ago, um, asking you guys to send in some questions you have about the Chiefs, or just about anything in general. And I got quite a few responses. I'm going to be answering every single one of them in this episode. So, uh, stay tuned for that. And be sure to follow me on Instagram because this isn't the last time I'm gonna be doing something like this. And I guarantee you, if you send me a question, I will answer it, I promise you. Even if I get a thousand questions, I will sit down here for three hours and answer all of them because I'm dedicated. But anyway, uh, let's get into the video. First question we got from Cameron, who is winning the Super Bowl? Next question from Ashton, an incredibly awesome guy. Was Matt Castle the Chiefs goat? Uh, is grass green? Is the sky blue? Is Tom Brady washed? Do I like ice cream? Next question from Joey, another really awesome guy. Uh, what do you think the Chiefs franchise will look like in 10 years? Now I know this is a tough pill to swallow, um, but for me personally, I believe that the team isn't going to be as good as it is now in 10 years. Um, simply due to the fact that the talent we have now is just incredibly, I mean, it, it's going to be hard to replicate. Um, we're still going to have Patrick Mahomes, and you know, we're really going to see in 10 years if he can still perform well with a completely different team. You know, a lot of people right now are saying the only reason he has success is because he's got Tyree Kill, Travis Kelsey, Andy Reid, but in 10 years, you know, we might not have any of those guys. Um, so we're going to see, you know, it's going to be interesting, but we're going to see. Next question from Demon. What's up? How you doing? Uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm doing. <laughs> That's all I can really say. I'm, I'm, I'm doing, you know. It's... Your mom. Now we got a question from Audrey. How long has it been since you supported the Chiefs? Um, I've supported the Chiefs pretty much since the moment I began to comprehend uh, the game of football. Um, so, you know, probably around 10 years, give or take. Next question from Moth. Who are you looking at for Chiefs draft picks? Um, I'm looking for an interior lineman. Um, I know a lot of people want us to go after a fast wide receiver um, because uh, Sammy Watkins is going to be a free agent soon, but I'm looking for a very, very solid, um, healthy interior lineman to protect Patrick Mahomes. Our offensive line has been beat up all season. So I'm looking for a guy like Rashawn Slater or maybe even Jalen Mayfield, you know, uh, either one of those guys I would be very, very happy with. Question from Z Green 108 who's your favorite player of all time? Um, now this is going to be controversial, but my favorite player of all time is Jamal Charles. Um, I know, I know, Patrick Mahomes was great, you know, MVP, all that. But come on, man, I gotta give Jamal credit. I grew up watching this guy tear up the league, and I have such, you know, I just have such a deep love for that guy. I mean, he's just, he's incredible. I love the guy, and I think he doesn't get enough credit when a lot of people talk about who the best Chiefs players of all time are. Um, Jamal Charles, I just feel like he's kind of left off a lot of people's lists, and I just want to give him the credit I feel like he deserves. So, yeah, I know Patrick Mahomes, he's probably going to end up taking that number one spot in a couple of years, but, you know, gotta give Jamal credit. Next question from Bomb Riley. How do you think Mahomes got into football? Um, I think Mahomes got into football because, you know, his dad was a professional uh, pitcher back in the day. And I know that doesn't make much sense, but Mahomes inherited that athletic ability. And I think he used that um, when he was in high school to play basketball, play football, you know, play, you know, those three main sports. And I think, you know, from there, it was just deciding which one he really wanted to play. I know for a fact he got drafted by the Tigers. He could have played uh, professional baseball. And I know for a fact he would have been good. Um, but you know what? He just loves football a lot more and he's tearing the league up right now. So you can't blame him. You know, got to give him credit. Good decision by Pat. Next question from Nate Dog. Who's the best player Chief got? Uh, well, best player Chief got is Pat. Frankly, I think he's definitely the best. Um, you could argue uh, Travis Kelsey, but you can't really. You can't really argue anybody. I mean, it's Patrick Mahomes. Uh, now we got one final question from, uh, who is this? Uh, what? Uh, Alix? Uh, Alix? Dare Langentone. All right, uh, weird name, uh, but uh, we got, how are you so hot and awesome and cool? Uh, well, uh, because I can do this. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed that video. I'll see you guys in the next Chiefs chat. Peace out.